This is one of the most interesting things on the breakfast bar. <laughs> I have to step back, it's such a, a long ladle. <laughs> it keeps coming. <laughs> things have to hide you, maybe taller. The small one, and this is like oatmeal stuff, right? It's a little yeah. sweet. Yeah. Arabian oatmeal. There's some coconut. Oh, something I made. Uh, something they have in all the hotels around here, in a lot of the public buildings and public spaces, are these prayer rooms. It's a Muslim country, so there's provided a place for prayers. During a couple times during the day, as you heard earlier today, there was a prayer that was, uh, they, they do a 15 minutes before prayer time, they announce there's gonna be a prayer soon, and then they do the prayer publicly, and it's on loudspeakers through most of the city. We're in a business district, and it's not, we don't hear it where we're at here, but it does happen throughout all the cities, major cities, and probably even small towns all over this part of the world. It's very interesting. It's kind of soothing. Unless you get woken up by it at 4.30 in the morning. Which, hey, if you're into it, it's probably, probably cool. Hey friends, today we're taking a little adventure into the streets of Dammam, Saudi Arabia, to a kite shop. Believe it or not, there are there are kite shops here, or at least one. Cool. Kite world. So Scott's got these stickers. This is him. We're in this kite shop. What are you gonna do with this? I think I'm gonna give it to the owner. Right on. Maybe I'll just stick it somewhere. Maybe you should. It's not just kites, guys. They have they have a hacky board. Some other games. You can get some other stuff. You can get a, you can get a dust a duster. <laughs> If you guys are ever in Dammam, you want to buy a kite, there you go. Just speak Arabic and there you go. Bag it. Found the new Sky Shark series here. <laughs> Sky Shark rods. <laughs> Friends, this kite shop is pretty cool. It's really interesting. I am gonna buy. I'm not gonna buy this one, but my friend here. This. You want my? No, I'm not gonna. Get, I'm not gonna get this one. This is a cool one, though. It's a fishing kite. Yeah. But, but this is the one. This is the one. What do you think about this one back here? That's it. Very beautiful. Yeah. I think so too. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna take it home. I'll show you me flat. Let's forget this boy. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's okay this though. He said it's for, for girls, girls and not for boys, for boys, but I still like it anyway. I like the colors on it. Can cover your face, and you will be a girl like like Arab like women. I don't think so, man. <laughs> I'll take one of those too. It's pretty cool right there. Wow. And then underneath the... Oh, oh ten, that? ten real. Yes. Yeah. So we're in a market here. This is like a street market. Not a lot going on today. Not the busiest day of the week for marketing, but we're out here just checking it out. Brant. How long do you think it'd take you to go through one of those bottles of cologne? Two or three days. 
Yeah? Yeah. I know you wear it heavy. I, I go heavy on it. Kitty! Some things you guys usually see, but not usually in Arabic. It's cool to see all these common things that we normally purchase in the grocery stores and what have you, and it's in different languages. It's pretty neat. So the way these markets work, there's like a row of watch stores, then there's a row of kitchen stuff, there's a row of furniture, and all the, all the stores in that section are all selling the same thing. I've never seen so many watches in my life than I have on this trip. There's, we've passed at least 15 watch stores. It was like this in the airport too. Watches are hot on the streets here. Watches everywhere. Hey, there's, there's clocks. You come in here for a watch? Yeah. Or did you come in here for cufflinks? I found something amazing here. I found something amazing. We found the candy store, or a section of a pharmacy with candy in it, and guess what I found? All kinds of interesting candies. And look at all the Harbo. They even have the Coca-Cola bottles. I've never seen these before. Oh yeah. They even have the Happy Cherries. Crossing the street is not, not the most fun thing of, of our day. You just gotta go. You just gotta walk and then not look at the traffic and they'll they'll usually stop for you. This is where you wash your feet when you're done using the restroom here. If you need to do any serious business in the restroom, you better know how to use these or you're out of luck. There's no there's no uh it's not a normal bathroom situation as most of us know it. You buying some gold, dude? It's a tough one to pick a bag, huh? I mean, do you go with like the ugliest thing you've ever seen? Or do you go with something bold? I've never shopped for a purse, Dan, but I have no idea how to advise you on this one. Yeah. You know, I'm looking for a place to live. Maybe I should, maybe I should just check this place out. Dress shop. That's beautiful. So it's about 11.30 and all the shops close up about this time. And then they reopen at about 4.30. Oh, spats! Leather boots! You got leather boots too, size 11? Oh yeah, those are nice. I did some shopping too, but mine's uh, smaller packages. Oh, jewelry. Oh, oh yeah. Cool. And I went back, see, too. Right on. Done, I love I love the kite. Uh, the kite dress? The kite dress, yeah. Yes, I'm, I'm um, using the modesty okay. four here, plus the little kiting element thrown in. Perfect. Fun. <laughs> I'll take a picture. Here, how about take a... Take a Harbo Berry. I'll test drive. Here we go. I'm going in. How do you like it? Wonderful. Delicious. I highly recommend it. The sewer system in Demam is just okay. Friends, I just took the lid off and see what they do to you? Makes it look like a full container, but it's not a full container. It's just a half container. It's okay though, because we're all going to share them. Yeah, that's a cool ride. We will make it a Mexican chicken.
chicken, okay? So, yeah. I did the same thing. I got the shot down low. This is one of the most rad things that we've ever done. <laughs> That's how you do it, guys. What's going on? Mm, we're gonna throw some uh, homemade planes. Maybe, I don't know, hopefully we don't hit anyone. So this has a number of possible outcomes. Land dolphin. <laughs> Let's go into the next part. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> nice little ladder walking back. Good day, Nizors, please, guys. Okay. Let's go. Pure coffee, it's time to say goodbye. It's Rhonda Brewer with World's Greatest Kiting over there. Your glasses are going on walkabout. Oh, wait, you gotta do this. You gotta do this. Oh, yes, yes. Where'd you get these sunglasses? These are the coolest sunglasses ever. They're the world's greatest rock and, greatest. rock and the sunglasses. Would you say they're the world's greatest sunglasses? World's greatest kiting sunglasses <laughs> is what they are. Boom. Don't right suck there. Up the hip. I so wanted to say. World's greatest kiting. <laughs> Check out our YouTube channel. Hi. <laughs> Until tomorrow, happy flying.